Hey there. It feels like a breath of fresh air to touch your feet to the earth. Have you ever heard of grounding before? So many people walk into our office and they say, hey, I'm experiencing a low level chronic anxiety consistently throughout the day. Makes sense. We live in an urban area, an urban environment where there's constant stress around you. One of the most simple techniques that had a, has had a profound impact on my own personal health has been touching my feet to the earth as much as possible. It actually has changed my life and my own health in such a profound way. I can tell when I don't ground myself, what happens is my anxiety increases drastically. So it's part of my routine now every morning where I touch my feet to the earth. When we are able to ground ourselves, we're literally tapping into the electrical grid of the earth. Truly, we're tapping into the electrical power of the earth and our cells have an electrical current running through them as well. So when we touch the earth, we're literally grounding our bodies to allow for the electrical circuit that runs through our entire system to work at a higher level, to function better. And what else do you want? On top of that, when we ground ourselves, what we're doing is we are allowing our cells, which are like little factories, to have the capacity to function higher. So if you picture your body like a battery, right? You have to recharge the battery. And so by touching the earth, by literally touching the earth, what you're doing is you're recharging the battery. So one of the things you can easily do in your life, even during the winter, is put your hands and feet on the earth. If there's snow on the ground, there's ice on the ground in the upcoming months here in Chicago, what you can do is touch a tree. You can breathe the fresh air. You can be outside in nature, even if you aren't touching the ground, it has a similar capacity. The other thing you could do in your life is you could buy a grounding mat. Many of our patients have bought grounding mats that they plug into their wall that naturally ground them when they're at home. Those two simple strategies can help you find the health that you're seeking because you're going back on how our ancestors lived. Think about how our ancestors evolved, right? They were waking up almost sleeping on the earth, waking up and the first thing they're doing is going to cook breakfast by the fire or they're going to hunt or they're going to watch their crops, they're going to milk their cows, they're going to grab their chickens, right? So they're, they were on the earth, they were they were interacting with nature every day. They didn't have to think about this, but us, because we live in an urban area, the majority of us, thinking about how we interact with nature and how we touch the earth is a, comp a very important component to health. So if you aren't touching the earth every day, I suspect that your health isn't as good as what it could be. And if you're watching this video, you wanna optimize your health, and so do I. I'm Dr. Colby from Haven. If you haven't already, hit subscribe below so you can learn tips and tricks of how to thrive on our planet today.